thing up. Okay. Oh, there's two packs in here. So here's the unopened package right here. There's another one in here as well that's unopened, but I'm just showing off one of them. All right, let me give this an open here. All right. Okay. So for one, it's a very small uh, cookie slash biscuit. I don't know if you can see that, but that's really what it looks like. That's a Joff cake right there. It smells like dark chocolate. It's very, very soft to the touch. Guess bottoms up, right? Okay. <laughs> hmm. Hold on, I'm gonna have to do another bite here. Hmm. So I can definitely taste the jam in there. It's very pungent. It's sweet, but it's not too sweet. It's very tart. I'm gonna have to try another one. Hold on. I need to get the, the full feel in here because sometimes I have to try something more than once. So, uh -huh. mm. I'm thinking, I'm, I've never had anything like this before, so it's really hard to describe. Um, okay, so the closest thing I can think of in terms of like how the cookie feels, Rumble, you've had uh, vanilla wafers, right? I believe so, yeah. Okay, so... Think of a vanilla wafer, but much softer. But it's a similar texture, but it's softer like a sponge. Uh, but it's, yeah, it's it's really hard to describe. The closest thing I can think of is a very soft, delicate version of a vanilla wafer. And it has, like, it's not a jelly, but it's more like a, like a jam or like a... A preserve without the preserves. And the dark chocolate's really not that bad either. Hmm. Hmm. Like, every time when I try one, I notice something different about it. It's so weird. Hold on. I'll give my full conclusion in a minute. I'm not eating all these because I like them just yet. I'm t this is a new type of flavor. So, I really got to think about this one. Hold on. It honestly, honestly tastes similar to something that I got um, imported from Mexico once. Because Mexico and Panama have, like, interesting snacks where they mix, like, chocolate with like something that's fruity it's so weird i i don't know if i like them i'm i'm stuck on the fence with it <laughs> like i could see why people don't wouldn't like these i can see that but i've had really bad things in my life and this does not go anywhere near that I'd have to definitely try the uh, brand that people want me to try. But in terms of these... Oh, man. Um, I could probably give it like a 7.5. It's like... You can taste like the small thin layer of the dark chocolate. You can definitely taste the jam. The problem is, is that the jam isn't too strong. But I could see why people wouldn't like it. If you don't really like fruity things, you probably wouldn't even like this. That's the best way that I can put it. 
But uh, I I can kind of dig it. I I I can dig it. I'm probably gonna eat this whole fucking sleeve. <laughs> now let me just eat this the way that I've uh, seen um, my friend Red Tozer eat it. She just pops the whole damn thing in her mouth. So. Uh. Okay, that is a different experience. Hold on. The jam pops if you do the whole thing in your mouth. Mm. I can dig that. Yeah, 7.5. I, I can dig that. 